So you guys, I just had my wig sale and I freaking sold out in four minutes. You guys are amazing. Like, I'm just so grateful. I'm just like, wow. I'm blown away. Anyway, I'm about to get up out of here. It's gonna be a busy day at the post office. Hopefully, you know what? I think I'm gonna go to a different post office this time. Cause the post office that's over here, like they don't have like, it's supposed to be like a little open bin thing that you can like throw packages into. But this one over here, they just, they don't have it. Cause if they don't have that, then I put it in the little blue thing that goes in the wall. You just like pull a little thing out, a little mailbox that's in the wall. So I just put all the packages in there, but they don't like when you put all the packages in there because when people want to put like their actual mail in there, like the envelopes and stuff, like your big old packages are taking up all the space. So you guys, I went over to Dollar Tree just to go pick up some more shampoo and conditioner. This is the type of conditioner and shampoo that I like to use and it's amazing. I love it. Here are some glasses and stuff that I was taking a look at because I'm in the process of trying to move right now and I saw that they had a lot of really nice dishes. I was really surprised by it, honestly. This is a little plastic section for the key. Here's for the grown-up sis, okay? Like, look at this plate. This does not look like something that you would get from Dollar Tree for a freaking dollar like this is so bomb they had like these gray plates look really nice but I really really wanted this white plate that I'm about to show you guys right now I really like white plates they just make everything look really nice and fancy but they had these there for only one dollar so definitely have to cop those like for sure gotta get that and then here are some champagne glasses that I was looking at I thought these were really nice too only for a dollar perfect for when you're just trying to settle down and have a relaxing Sunday you know what I'm saying make a mimosa or some and then these were just some really nice cups too that i was taking a look at but yeah dollar tree y'all that's the plug they got a lot of really nice kitchenware and then look they had mason jars down there too that i was looking at you know what i'm thinking about getting some of these for my goddaughter because like these little cups for when she come over because she be coming over and i only be having big people stuff i don't be having stuff for babies because i don't got no kids so i think i want to get something like this or even like, look at these, hold on. They got these cute little trays. Look at these cute little trays. So when she come over and she eat, she have a cute little place. They got pink ones. You know I'm probably gonna get the pink ones because I love pink. They even have this little bowl where you can, you know, I guess drink your cereal out of it when you're done. I think this is cool. So y'all, they couldn't give me a bag. So they put everything in a box. They ain't got no more bags. They said, bitch, you in a box. We got some empty boxes back here. I'm like, fuck it, put it in the box, shit. Look at these two. This is all they do all day is fight. So yeah, these are all of the wigs. Well, these aren't all the wigs. These are most of them. I have more that are still drying in my bathroom. I have a lot of curly units. As you guys can see, most of the units from this cell were curly. I have a straight one here. I have a couple of more straight ones, but, um. These were the ones that just air dried overnight. I have some more that are still kind of trying to dry right now. So I'm about to pack up these orders. I have one right here that's drying that I put on here to like help it dry. I like to let my wigs air dry. I really don't like to blow dry them because when you don't blow, you gotta stop. But um, when you don't blow dry them, it just looks better. You know, when you blow dry them, it's just not the best. Excuse my background. I live here, so I have stuff around. Two more units over here that I have to customize and get those ready. Are you guys still fighting? Pee Wee, you're the culprit, I know it. Yeah. What are you doing, Pee Wee? Are you fighting? Are you fighting? Hmm? You guys are so cute. I should take a picture like this. You guys are just adorable. Picture. <laughs> so here are some more units so after i wash all my units i pretty much put them on this little rack in my bathroom so that they can dry this is one i finally actually kept it in the same style but i did clean like the lace or whatever so it's not a bunch of like crusty stuff on it so that's clean this is another unit another unit another unit letting those air dry but wait there's more i have these wigs drying this is the orange unit that i loved this was like cinnamon actually but it looks orange um, this is another unit and this is a braided unit. So I'll show you guys the lace. Like, it's clean right here. It's like nothing right here, but it looked like it's stained on the other side. So yeah, there's that. And I washed this. I'm selling this wig just as is. I didn't want to like um, braid it because I feel like 
whoever bought this, they probably wanted it with the beads and the braids. Like, they would be a disappointment, I'm sure, if I sent this, like, regular. Because this is really just a full lace wig. It looked like just like this when I undo it, so. You guys, this is in my room. I got more wigs in here. This is a bunch of other wigs. Like, some of these, I know you see it, it's still got the lace on it. Um, This one is an older one that I'm selling, but yeah. I got all these other units, so that kind of told y'all I got wigs on wigs on wigs. Like, this is the life of the taste maker, girl. We got wigs on wigs on wigs. I be busting my ass to get these videos up and out, trying to come up with new hairstyles all the time, reselling the wigs, and then, you know, trying to do my own thing, so... It's a lot that be going on, y'all. It's a lot that be going on. But I'm just glad that you guys enjoy these vlogs. Because, like I said, if you guys enjoy the vlogs and I see y'all really fuck with them like that, I vlog a lot more. But we gonna see. Sis, we gonna have to wait and see. Because I gotta ship these wigs out, drop them off, and come back here. And I have to film two videos today, y'all. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'm gonna do it. Because I'm a boss-ass bitch. And we just get shit done. We don't, we don't worry about how. We just worry about doing it. You know what I'm saying? look like it's a lot but it is it's because they're all like really flat in here this one i had to um rip open because i messed up on this one so sorry girl when you see this one with the tape on it i apologize i apologize i had to fix that one um but yeah so these are all of the orders now i'm gonna take these bags out look how big these bags are okay shipping them out honey i remember when i used to only just have one bag and that was just this now i got two what it do and i could fit a couple more in here but yeah so i'm about to go ahead and drop these off at the post office and do some instagram promo and stuff like that so all right y'all so i have to go to a different post office because this one doesn't have the bin that i need But this post office doesn't have the bin that i need like it's like usually like a big old bin where you can just put all the packages inside of there so I know of another one that has it. 
so I'm gonna go there um, and drop all these packages off. But I wanna try one that's a little closer, like, I wanna try this other one up the street. I'ma see if they have the little bin that I need. If they don't have it, then I'ma go to this other one. Which means I have to go to Culver City, which is not far from me, but it is like going the opposite direction. So from where I wanna go, because after I drop off these packages, I gotta go make another little stop and then um, get something to eat and then go back home. All right, y'all, so this one didn't have it either. So I gotta go to freaking Culver City, which is the opposite way. I mean, I could drop them off here and just make my life easier. Let me just drop these off because I don't feel like driving to Culver City. People, I don't know, the, the packages is finna go in, these damn, in this damn mailbox. I'm gonna do one bag and then I'm gonna see if the other one will fit or whatever. Okay, you guys, so I was able to drop everything off. I'm just trying to get my brush right now. This girl, even when I'm, you know, some plain Jane shit, I'll at least like to look decent, okay? So anyway, right now I'm about to go ahead and order something from Doolin's. Like I told you guys, I wanted to get something to eat from there. Um, I just dropped everything off in this post office. I was just like, look, if people can't fit their stuff in here, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> But like, I was not finna drive all the way to freaking Culver City right now. I barely even wanna go do the errand that I gotta go run as it is. I don't know why they have a handicapped parking right here. This is so funny. <laughs> How you gonna have handicapped street parking, my nigga? It's the fucking street. Handicapped street parking? I've had enough. I haven't brought y'all to do ones in a long ass time. First things first, we wanna put our handy dandy mask on. Boop. Boop. Boom. Now I'm now I'm incognito. <laughs> I would be surprised if the crime rate didn't go up during this quarantine time because like everybody could just walk around with masks on and stuff. Like you don't, you can't describe nobody right now. What did he look like? I don't know, he had a mask on. Well what color was the mask? <laughs> Nigga gotta switch out his mask so the police don't find him and shit. So I got my gloves on, I got my mask on. Let's go in here and do lens and go get us something to eat, Shadow Love. Cause I'm hungry. Damn. Look at him, he got his son, that's so cute. Well, let me go. But yeah, I'ma holler at y'all when I get out of do lens cause y'all know I haven't vlogged in a minute so I have to get used to this. All right, y'all, we back in the damn car. They, I wish, oh my gosh, like, I wish I was recording this whole situation right now because this shit was so fucking irritating. So I go in here, it's not a lot of people in here. Um, remember I told you, I was like, oh, Sam, it was like a whole family that just went in. So the family that went in, they were already um, at the little thing ordering their food, right? And it was, a, it was a man that was in front of me and that was it. So it was just the family, the man, and then, um, can't even see because I got y'all in the thing. I can't see my back, my rear viewing camera. Hold on. Let me get up out of here real quick. All right, y'all. So I made it back to the house. I'm about to wash my hands real quick and then um, eat this food. Yeah, I'll show y'all what I got. But yeah, they were just really slow up there. And then like, so it's one person that like takes your order. They do like the first couple sides and then they slide it down. And then the second person does the rest of your sides, right? So after she got done taking hella long, like she was asking me dumb shit. Like, so I told her I want the uh, the pork chops with the rice, right? And uh, she gonna ask, do you want the rice? Do you want the rice underneath the meat? Duh, bitch! Don't you put rice underneath the meat? Like, what the fuck kind of dumb question is this? Like, usually when you get any type of meat with rice, do you put your rice on top of your meat? No. You put the meat on top of the rice. And then it's rice with it's rice with it, right? You're supposed to put the gravy from the meat. She goes and gets the gravy that's for the mashed potatoes to put on my rice. I said, this dumbass hoe, whatever. It's all going to taste the same. I'm not even going to tell her nothing. But it's two different gravies. You know what I mean? When they say you want the gravy, they usually mean like the juice from the meat. 
onto your rice, not actual gravy. Then, so they slide it down, and then uh, the other dude, he was slow. They already put the rice underneath. <laughs> he gonna ask, did you want rice? Nigga, I already got the fucking rice. The rice is already in there. It's at the bottom of the meat. It's in there already. He was like, oh, okay, so macaroni and cheese. And he was looking at the frame. He was like, okay, was there anything else? I'm like, greens? She wrote greens on the, f oh my God. Like, I'm like, oh, these damn people. They both were just irritating the fuck out of me there. Then they didn't have no straws. They're not giving out no straws for the drinks. So I got to just sip out of the uh, cup thing, which I hate doing. Like I have plastic straws, you guys. I only have two left. But I always keep plastic straws in my house. Plastic straws. They're reusable too. You can wash them. But I never wash them. I throw them away. Because I'm not going to wash a straw. How fucking dumb do I look? <laughs> so I'm hungry. I'm about to snatch this wig off too. And eat my food. But before I do that, I'm going to show y'all what I got from Doolin's. Alright y'all. So look. Everything is written on here. My name is E, apparently. I told her my name was D. She put fucking E. That was the fucking... I was like, nigga, E, I said D. But the nigga, it says greens right here. And he asked me what my other side was. And it says greens on here. That's why I was saying, like, they was irritating the fuck out of me because they just slow up there. But this is my food, nonetheless. There's my macaroni and cheese. There's my greens. They didn't pack it on how they normally do. But boom. Here's my smothered pork chops. The rice is under there with the gravy. And then they give you cornbread on the side. So this is the cornbread. And this is the real kind of cornbread. This is not Jiffy cornbread. This is that real deal. So that's why I like this. Because you got to have cornbread. You know what I'm saying? You got your good old greens. You know what I'm saying? I want to know this. Do y'all smash up y'all cornbread and put it inside of your greens? Or do you eat them like you just take a bite and then you eat your uh, greens? How y'all do yours? I like mine in my greens. Let me just show y'all an example. So I'll like do something like that up in that thing. It's hard to do it with one hand. Ooh, and it's hella hot. This damn thing is hot as hell, being in that foil. But yeah, I like to do mine like that. And I eat mine like that. <laughs> like, how you eat your greens? I want that up. But yeah, so that way, when you pick up your bites, you already got a little bite of cornbread, and you got your little, you know what I'm saying? And typically, I don't like my food to touch. So stuff like this, where my greens is in my macaroni and cheese, like, I hate that. Like... I would normally like eat around that part. That's just how weird I am. I've always been that way. I don't like my food to touch. That's why I hate people making my plate. But like, boom, I got the, ooh, with the, you see them onions up in there? I haven't ate pork chops in a long time. I normally don't even eat pork. But yeah, this is my din din slash lunch because it's my first meal of the day. So y'all, I'm about to tear this food up. Then I have to edit some videos and stuff and get these videos done and then I have to record later on tonight. What's up y'all? So I just finished recording a video. Oh, that sounded like a car accident. And a quick update, you guys, it was actually a car accident. So that loud crash that you guys heard, there was a car accident at the intersection and one of the cars, the whole front was like completely totaled to where like the bumper, I don't know, the front bumper part was like off. But anyway, hopefully they're okay i don't know what happened to them people but god bless them anyway let's get back to the vlog good morning you guys so today i'm about to go look at an apartment i'm about to go look at an apartment and i'm so excited so um i've been having a hard time trying to find an apartment you guys because at first i had to just narrow it down what the hell was that I had to narrow it down to places that accept dogs because you guys know I have dogs. So I have to find a place that accepts dogs. Um, I'm actually about to go view a place right now. Um, I have my sister meeting up with me because it's in North Hollywood and she stays in North Hollywood already. And the place is literally like five minutes away from my sister. So I'm about to meet up with her right now. Um, it's probably gonna take me about like 30 minutes to get down there. So I'm about to start leaving literally right now. Um, and then I have to view another place on Wednesday but hopefully this place works out for me. I don't know. I'm going to apply and uh, I'm going to apply today and then see, you know, what happens. I'm still going to go view the one on Wednesday. Check that one out. They did want me to come today to view the place, but I was like, today is too crazy. Tomorrow I have to film. So Wednesday will be my next day that's available. So, and today's Monday, by the way. <laughs>
right now because I had looked up my package and I seen that it was delivered yesterday at like 10 o'clock in the morning my package was there but they just couldn't find it yesterday so I went back up there this morning and they found my package and another package anyway but I'm gonna open up this box with y'all because it's some new shoes and girls love shoes do we not we do okay y'all so this is a weird angle I have y'all on the table <laughs> I figured this would be fine but I don't know, I can't move it back in there. Hold on. Let me see if I can move it back some. So anyway, I'm opening this up with a cone because, hello? Hello? Cool. So this is the box. Let's go ahead and take it down. So once again, this is what the box looks like. Sides. And then here they go. Looks like it. Damn, why do they look you look kind of big for a second? These are so bomb. So these are the shoes. Ew, they're so cute. And then here's the other one. Okay, so here are the shoes. That's what they look like. Forward to the side. Super cute, right? I love these. The reason why I got these, though, because I've been wanting these shoes for, like, a really long time or whatever, and then I forgot about them. But what made me think about these again is because Converse has been doing a lot of different collabs. They have, like, these platform shoes that I want that have, like, almost, like, you know, like, the bottom of, like, a work boot. It has that type of vibe to it. Everybody's wearing a Rick Owens uh, sneaker, and I was like, I'm not finna spend, like, $750 for those sneakers because they just remind me of checks. So I was like, I'm just giving me a pair of checks. These were cute um simple they come in different colors and different styles but i just picked this one because it's just like classic simple you know what i'm saying anyway i'm about to drink my smoothie i got a smoothie and i'm hungry so i'm gonna eat and drink my smoothie i'll talk to you guys later because i'm gonna be vlogging today um a lot i guess like my whole day pretty much today i'm going to my friend kelly's house and tyler of course is coming um we have to go get the seafood because we're going to do a seafood boil. We're just having like a cute little girls night or whatever. So we're going to go get the seafood in a couple of hours. So I'll pop you guys back out when we go over there. Um, I don't know. Tyler may not want me to record though. So y'all, I'm about to do my nails. I asked you guys on Instagram which nails I should do. Oh, damn. I almost, I almost dropped everything. So yeah, you guys, I'm about to do my nails. I'm going to put these on. These are these cheetah nails. I asked you guys on Instagram which ones I should do, and you guys voted on these ones. So I'm going to go ahead and put these on right now. These are, like, so freaking cute. I can't wait to put them on. They're supposed to be pretty long, too. So yeah, and then I'm going to put my cute rings on because I haven't worn my rings in a minute because I'm like, what's the point of wearing rings if you don't have any nails on? Tell me what you say now. Tell me what you say, come again. If you cannot stay down Then you do not have to pretend Like there is no way out I said I'll never let you in Cause you got me face down And don't take this personal But you're the worst, you know what you've done to me And although it hurts, I know I don't need you, I don't need you, but I want you 
back to not depend on nothing or no one So why would you show up so uninvited? Just change my mind like that Please don't take this personal But you ain't shit and you ain't special Till I made you so You better act like you know That I've been through worse than you Talking, y'all. She be talking. What you talking about? Huh? What you talking about? Oh, she just woke up from a nap. She don't care. She like what? Usually she be like Dumbo, Dumbo, Dumbo. No Dumbo today. Say Dumbo. See how she looked off on it. <laughs> I said no Dumbo today. She said yeah, and then I say say Dumbo, and she looked away. That's all right. But anyway, so right now we're about to go get some uh, some seafood real quick from this little spot. Yeah, so that's pretty much all we're doing right now. I'm makeup free all weekend. Hello? I don't need it. I don't. I'm not going to use it. Oh, that's what I got to make sure I do. Make sure I bring some damn uh, some of these eyelash glue. Wow. Look at Ty. Hey, Ty. Hey, now. <laughs> you know I'm TMZ with this stuff. You should be used to it by now. Look, your hair is done. Your hair ain't looking crazy all upside the head. And then, you know, shoot. She not messing. <laughs> hey, damn. No, when you get big and them coins start kicking in oh, you with gonna... extra zeros, I'm going to hold on to this moment and remember. I'm like, hey, bitch, I, I need waiver. my fee for this. <laughs> all right, I'm just getting the top <laughs> button in. Just the top button. <laughs> Put the address in. So here is a little bit of my crab boil. Shout out to Ty for the fire crab boil, man. I've been eating seafood like a mug, y'all. But shout out to her for this. And here is the next morning. What's up, y'all? Good morning. Don't judge my hair. I just got out of the shower. So don't judge my hair, okay? It's the next morning. I didn't um, vlog yesterday when we got out here. But yeah, so I came to visit my friend Kelly or whatever. And you know the crazy part about these apartments? Oh, look at this little dog. I see that dog over there. Hey, baby. Sticky pooey. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hello. He's trying to get to the dog. Y'all see him? Oh, that dog ran away. <laughs> the dog ran. <laughs> He like, hell no, nigga, I don't know you could. Who the fuck is you could? I'm gonna record when I come back. Y'all see this clear skin? Get into it, my nigga. This is the vibe. Hello? Get into this natural beauty. Honey, stop playing with me. Oh yeah, yesterday we wasn't really doing shit, so that's why I didn't record, cause we just, Tyler didn't finish cooking the crab boil until basically like one o'clock in the morning. It was hella late. By the time she finished, she didn't even want to eat. So I got to go to Best Buy because I wanted to get some AirPods. But I'm wondering if I should wait. I don't know. I'm going to see what their prices is like out here. If the price is right, then I'll get some now. I seen some I could order online. It was like $125 for some AirPods. So I'm like, that's pretty good. Because, you know, they be expensive. <laughs> I don't know why they be so sensitive. My goodness, Apple. Trying to take all your money, honey.
pretty much the end of the vlog i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog i know it's all over the place i'm doing all types of things um but i didn't really vlog that much while i was here just because we weren't really doing anything but, like sitting here watching tv like just even now like it's just me right now watching tv or the tv's watching me <laughs> so yeah um pretty chill weekend just chilling with my friends you know not really doing anything vibing out it's certain stuff that i could have recorded but you know not everybody likes to be on camera as much as i do even though like i signed up for youtube that is me other people have so i haven't been um vlogging or whatever because i don't want to vlog people and they don't want to be in the vlog you know but anyways i'm gonna close out this vlog here i hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you guys in my next one Deuces.